Hello everyone, welcome back to ANC Studios with host ANC, and today we are playing some lovely Kindergarten 2, because no one can stop us. So today we, I think I'm gonna, I mean, we got the last mission for the big finale. We did get a little bit of a sample of it with the Breaking Sad, I believe, because it's Billy and Lily right here. So we do got things that go boom. So it's start the mission by giving Carla the laser module, which we need the laser module, the A+, plus, and the plushy thingy. Resume. Okay, A+, plus, laser beam, watch the plushy. Back. Okay, so we got all those three. Um, we did get some new costumes last episode I'm kind of excited about. But I think we're going to stay with this one because, I'll be honest, I do look like amazing Cindy. And let's continue on our first day. Hi, you must be one of the new kids. I'm Carla. Do you have any contraband on you? Do you want this? What the? No way! Where'd you get that? How'd you get it? This is incredible! With this I can finally... Finally what? Kid! Clear your schedule! We got a lot of work to do! What are you talking about? This laser model, and with that principal's kid transferring, I can finally get through with my little project, which is... You see, I'm pretty good about getting things around school. I've got keys, secret passages... And I know how to detangle with Stevie, okay? One problem, I've never been able to solve the getting from the passage of the teacher's lounge to the janitor's closet. Does the laser help? On its own, it doesn't, but I've heard stuff that went on with the other school. There was a lot of stuff. Oh yeah, <laughs> that was a train wreck. I'm talking about the little pocket bombs that were in listening to conversations. Oh yeah, those sucked. I need one, and you're gonna get it for me. Your friends are that, ki that crying kid over there, right? Not really. Well, you're gonna be. Find him a tissue or something and make me cheer him up, and you'll find one of those devices. It's worth a shot. So, remember from last episode, we accidentally got one from her. So, we got that. And then it's. Go away, kid! I don't know what you're talking about. I don't want to talk about it. You look like you use what? This. Sniff. Thanks, man. I can't believe they made. Me come to school day. Why? What's wrong? I'm not gonna tell you. You know what? That's what's the difference. Do you know why we're at the school instead of our old one? No. Something bad happened. They found my dad in some weird lab under his office. His head was missing. How awful. So now you know what I have to do then, right? Find a foster family? I have a mom. Jeez. I have to take revenge on who did this to my family. Who do you think did this? Lily, obviously, she was obsessed with my dad. It has to be her. She's not even here. That's that's what you think. I know she's here. I can feel it. Can you let me find her? Please, I need justice. I guess I can help you. Thank you. Now we just need to lead us or talk to Nugget. He was close to Billy and has a crush on Lily. Maybe he knows. Okay, then. So, do we talk to her? He wants to find Lily. Hmm. She was that girl whose brother went missing right interesting. You know, I did see the two kids sneaking the crossbows into the school. Could it be them? It wouldn't surprise me since that nugget kid caved in my secret passage this morning. We need another way to get down there. What are our options? I said we go through that grate. Here's a screwdriver. Let nugget that nugget kid out. I'll distract Bob so he doesn't notice it's open. Okay, so we gotta go over here. Help oh, nugget is dropped. I'm gonna get you out of here. Nugget is free, thank you for freeing Nugget. No problem. Nice job, kid. So this is n Nugget, huh? It is. Yes, Nugget is Nugget. Who is Bunny Tail Girl? I'm Carla. So you wouldn't have to have been seen anyone down there. Perhaps some kids and hoodies? Uh, Nugget is not supposed to say. Only those with secret stuff creature may know. Right. The secret. I've heard enough. Meet me the smart class kid. We've got work to do. Will do. That's the bell of one inside. Go to smart class. Welcome to the advanced class. If you are here, you have proven to be smarter than the other slugs you copy as. Please try to use the time constructively. Einstein was building great guns in kindergarten, so should you. Remember to fill out your daily assessment on the computer. Plus, if you take it, you get a school mandated prize. We don't have learning without incentive anymore. What a world. Okay. Good, you're here. We need to get down that cross space to confirm that girl's there. How do we get there? Why do you think I had you open the grate? Oh, yeah. It'd be easy enough. Here's the key to that door that will lead you to the handicap ramp. Let's go take our assignments. So, Dan, you're coming with me? 
I'm only following you downstairs. Make sure Stevie doesn't stop you from using that key. Got it. Hey, what gives? This is box of cleaning supplies. I thought we were getting prizes. The school mandates that I give up prizes. It doesn't mandate they have to be good prizes. So I grabbed something out of the janitor's closet. What a total ripoff. Okay, so I need to take the assessment. Take assessment. Thank you for taking your assessment. Please pick up the I mean, prizes. I'll take, um... The spray bottle works with the Cindy in the that, so let's do toilet paper this time. There you go. Enjoy your prize. Now, go to smart child things. Okay. Okay, let's go down. Dana probably won't stop us now. Okay. Let's go. Just two ladies. I just really think you two are going. The bathroom. Together. No. Okay. Just don't cause any trouble. Hey, the boys' bathroom's downstairs. You can go down, but you can't. Relax, man. The student handbook says I'm allowed to access a new student to finding the bathroom. Oh. Okay, I didn't know that. Thanks. My pleasure. Well, that guy's dumb, but Stevie isn't. Once he sees us, he'll make me go back upstairs. Then what? While he's doing that, use the key to get out before he comes back. Got it. We need to be back in class before the bell rings. I'll make another distraction for you so Stevie doesn't see you coming from the outside. Just don't be late. I won't be. Good. Let's go then. Okay. Hey, Carla, you're not supposed to be downstairs. The girls' bathroom is upstairs. The other monitors should have stopped you. Oh, that's right. So then, I mean, maybe you should walk me to there make sure I don't make any more mistakes. Don't play dumb with me. Come on, let's take you back upstairs. And now, run. <laughs> On that door. There we go. Now let's go back around. If it's so easy for kindergartners to be going around this place, then like, what do they expect from like, uh, you know, squeak the plushie? That's a signal. It's safe to come out. Finally, I feel like we've been waiting here a long time. We've been waiting here for hours. Who are you guys? Oh yeah, we should probably tell you that. It's us, a million billion. We've been spying on you guys. You discovered who I- do you want to hear about it? Jerome was after Lily. Me? Oh. I guess he blames me for what happened to his dad. Yep. So I wish I'd seen this coming, Billy. What's the big deal? He can't get to us, he doesn't even know we're here. We can't risk it. I have to confront him. He- he has to know the truth about, the truth about his father. Head back upstairs and tell Jerome to meet me in the girls' bathroom. Knock on the first stall twice. Okay. You should be back in class before the bell rings. You don't want to get study hall. Good idea. Okay, so let's go back around. Okay. Hey, CV is my friend still in the unacceptable Carla. I'm giving you study hall. You're not supposed to be down here. Come on, man. I'm just checking out my friend. He's fine. See. Now Go back upstairs for a second the principal's office. Okay, fine. Jeez. And you, you've been... You've had long enough for your bathroom break. Back upstairs now. Okay, relax. Good, you're back. I'll take this key. So what's the deal? Are the kids in there? Can we get them to... Can we get drunk with them? They'll be in the girls' bathroom. Good, let's show the crybaby the good news. Let's go. Did you find out anything about Lily? Do you know where she is? She'll be in the bathroom during lunch. So she is here, I knew it. I'm going to get her for what she did. Thanks, kid. I have a plan to get you there. We'll talk during lunch. I hope you all learned something, Dave. Please go to lunch. Okay. I need to get upstairs for the bathroom. I got some extra burgers, like you asked. What are they for? Stevie got a little extra irritated with me today. Now I have study hall. I'm not going to the principal's office for all this. So what can we do? We're going to start a food fight. It'll draw in all the wanderers and give you a chance to leave. We just need something big and dumb to start it. Sounds good. Okay, then you just need to find someone who's willing to start it. Once it starts, there should be enough chaos for you to get out of here. Got it. One more thing. While you're upstairs, get into the science class and change the lesson plan to robotics. I'm going to need some of that stuff to finish our little project. Got it. Okay. Uh, where'd Bugs go? There he is. Burgers are okay. I can't actually miss this. Can I miss this off? Want to start a food fight? Haha, <laughs> yeah I do. This place could use a little redecorating. So can Nugget's face. Let's do it.
You see there, kid, I'm starting a fight with that proper ammunition. Want some more food? Yes, bring me more burgers and we'll get this food fight right off. Okay. You could have mine. How many more do you need now? One more should do it. Go get one. Hurry up. Okay. I'll take a hamburger. Thanks. Get that burger for me? Here you go. Then let's get the show on the road. Hey, Nugget. Nugget does not wish to speak to. Catch. Nugget doesn't like burgers. Hey, Fatso, watch it. You mustn't do with that grease ball. Oh, my mistake. I'll make sure to hit you this time. Oof. Hey, that was rude. Come on, weird kid. We don't have to put up with this. Let's give him a taste of his own medicine. Nugget has never considered throwing food back at the nasty bully. Nugget normally just poisons them as enemies. But Nugget can make an exception this time. Oh, what the heck? I don't want to get involved with this stupid food fight. Unacceptable. This will not stand on my cafe. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so first we need to go upstairs. And we need to go to the science classroom first. Oh, it's locked. Okay, so we gotta go through the little great thingy. We do it. Oh, yeah. So, really just didn't knock on the stall. Hello, Jerome. Lily, you, you. You killed my dad! I'm gonna do it. he should have done. I'm gonna stop you and your crazy conspiracy theories. Jerome, wait! I can explain everything! Liar! I know where Bill- She's not lying. What? Of course she's lying. She's lying to save herself. Jerome, did you ever start to consider why your dad had explosives and why he would blow up when, you, when they mentioned my brother? Shut up! I'm sure there was a reason. It's because you were unstable. He knew you were after him. Yeah. Because he kidnapped my brother and turned him into a monster that makes pills. That sounds- that does sound crazy. You were there! You tell him! It's all true! It is true. Wait. You were there? You saw everything? She's telling the truth? Yep. And my dad, he was- Oh jeez, I think I'll be sick. I'm sorry, Jerome. Thanks for helping me clear things up with him. I'll see you soon. Bye, Lily. Can I- Move. Okay, we have a problem. Penny's coming upstairs. I think she knows where I am. We need to get out of here now. What do we do? There's gotta be another way out of here. Help me find it or we're all dead. That's perfect. Come on, guys. We're gonna go. Follow Lily. We should be safe in here. She won't be looking for long. What now? I'm gonna head back down to Billy. We still have a lot of work to do. I'm sure there's something we can do in here to wait out the time for recess. Okay. Good luck. And Jerome, I am sorry. We need to do robotics. Uh, robotics. What the? How'd you get my campus costume? Explain yourselves. We snuck it through the vent. Oh, that's rather clever. Not clever enough to avoid City Hall. But still, clever. Aw, oh, man. Look at the bad children today. There were a lot of you. Make some matters worse. Yeah, I can't get- I didn't get my coffee. No one move or talk. Just- Just be quiet. I'm just gonna close my eyes real quick. Zzz. Okay then. Did you work through your issues, Drum? I guess I did. I'm still processing it all, but I feel a little better. Good. So you're gonna need. So you're okay with part of the little device here? Oh, I already did. I think I left it on the bathroom floor upstairs. Great. Okay, kid. Let's go up there and grab that thing. Woohoo! We escaped study hall, cause it's not that hard to do so. Hey, you rat kids still doing up here. We're looking for a little device that was left on the ground. Have you seen it? Hey, hey, maybe I have. What's it for me if I tell you? I don't know. What do you want? Well, the cafeteria needs some cleaning spray. Uh, so we already got the toilet paper. Oh, okay. Yeah, okay. So we actually have to go there. A prize toilet paper. Cool, I get the spray bottle. Head to the boys' bathroom and drop it off. Meet me back here as soon as possible. Okay. Let's go to the boys' bathroom. The boys' bathroom. I didn't mean to leave. Uh. No. No. 
Here's some toilet paper. Oh yeah, I'll take care of it. Thanks, dude. You can go now. See ya. Bye! Okay. There you are. Do I toilet paper yet? Yep. Awesome. Let's go to the vice in the old coot. It will blow this lid off the place. Let's go. You do have a job for me? You bet. Good, maybe you kids aren't bad after all. Maybe I shouldn't have hit so many of you with my mop. That would be nice. Well then, you can leave me alone now. What about the vice? The what? Oh yeah, that little doo-doo. I put it in my lap at the cleaning cart. Bob left the door unlocked. Looks like he was dripping in there or something. You don't even have it with you? Come on, man. Deal with it, kid. I'll let the hall kid know to let you in. Now get out of here before you don't mind about hitting kids from up. Get out of here. Well, let's head down there. We're almost out of time. Okay. Hurry up. Come on, come on. We got this. Whoa. It's pretty hard to breathe. Once I blow a hole in the wall, it's air out nicely. Probably not bad. Bob out of his little trance. That'd be good. Let's get the device and head out of here. If we stay too long, we'll end up like him. Got it. There's a chainsaw, a shovel, on the shelf. Don't take anything. Uh, where's the device? Oh, did you say on the cleaning cart? Drew's device in the cart bag. Take the device. Cough. I don't know how much we can last in here. We gotta get the heck out of here. Got it. There's that. There we go. Perfect. Now go. Hide in here. Good. Now we just get back to our stage before the bell ring. Okay. Don't forget to pay your lab fee. I'll see you in science class. Got it. Huh? What? Oh. Must have dozed off for a moment there. Anyone who wants to come to science class, pay your lab fee. Otherwise, go to the gym. Go to science. Must go to science. Welcome to science class. Today's lesson will be about robotics. That's odd. I thought it was about plants. Anyway, robotics are a wonderful way to terrorize the tri state area. In front of you is my favorite kind of robotics, the hydraulic pet, the hydraulic press. Do we have any volunteers to stick their head under it? Anyone? You kids are no fun. Just go stick to some spare parts together and line it up. Okay, so let me talk to my girl. Time to break this sucker down. We need to deactivate the tricky mechanism so it doesn't blow our heads off. How do I do that? That's a good question. Maybe someone from your old school has experience dealing with this sort of thing. I'll ask around. Oh, my buddy Monty. Yeah. Not school and all, but sometimes if here comes close to what I've made. Can you act can you deactivate this? You know I can, but I just know I'll be doing it for free. How much? Twenty bucks. Uh, that's so expensive. Yeah. So are medical bills. Put up or shut up. Is there anything else I could do? Maybe there is something. I've seen you hanging out with Carla all day. Are you in good terms there? I guess so. Good, good. So what you say you drop a good word about me to her? Maybe you set up some little date? I can try. Well, you better try hard. Either you give me $20 or you set me for the day with the car. Okay. Got it. Well, did you find anyone to do it? Uh, Monty will. Okay, so why isn't he doing it? He wants to be your boyfriend. Uh, that's a grimy little, you know what? Fine, but I'm not happy about it. Okay then. Did you ask her? What did she, what did she say? He said yes. Ah, diggity dog, I can't wait. Uh, we'll be, a, we'll be a force to be reckless about the device. Oh yeah. Let's take a minute. There. Yeah. I didn't say I was listening on it. It won't pop unless you give a different method of exploding. Thanks, Monty. Sorry about how little dweeb that'll be his girlfriend and we'll get the move on. It's done. Great. Can't wait for this little date. Let's get crushing. Sounds good. Come on, crush the thing. Get on the pedestal and put it up in the crusher. Okay. I can place the thing to be crushed right here. Place the device. It looks like this electronic crusher pressed the button. You did it. This is exactly what we needed to finish the bomb. I can totally blow up in that wall now. Hooray! Ah, another day of landing is good. There's no breaking thing on the way out. Hopefully she actually doesn't. This just wasn't all in vain. <laughs> what a day. I can't believe we're able to build this thing so quickly, and you, you know what your bomb on top is? What? I had enough parts to make two bombs. How sick is that? You can have one for yourself. Oh, wow. Since it's used a paint, I should recognize it's contraband, so have fun with that. I'm sure we'll be working together soon. Yeah, maybe. You, know, you can also have this monster mind card. I'm just that impressed. Later, kid.
Later. Day complete. Carla's laser bomb. Ah, oh, that was another lovely day of kindergarten too. And I want to thank you all for watching. Make sure you guys like, subscribe, whatever you guys do want more. And I shall see you guys next time. Bye, guys. Oh, oh, oh.